Hello guys, we are back with our next tutorial. In this tutorial, let us go through the failure with loss of non-volatile storage. So basically, we have discussed about non-volatile storage. Non-volatile storage are nothing but your hard disk and etc. etc. Fine. Okay. So basically, even the non-volatile storages can cause failure or any kind of issues, guys. The best example for anything will be the natural calamities. Natural calamities, nothing can withstand, guys, basically. Okay. So to recover from failure that results in loss of non-volatile storage we should okay the best method is to store your non-volatile data into one more device so that whenever there is any issue we can recover them so we must dump the entire content of the database onto a sta stable storage i hope everyone remembers the concept of stable storage which stores the data in an efficient manner and permanently so we should do it periodically once a day so that even if we recover sorry if we lost the data the next day we can recover recover at least for today's information right so that will be an advantage when we compare with the complete loss so even if any failure occurs we can restore it safely so i hope everyone got at least a small idea on this topic this is a small topic guys okay so in the next tutorial we'll be going through shadow pacing so let us meet in the next tutorial thank you thanks for watching